Welcome back. On this video, we will be discussing the rules for safety in the use of uh, the miter saw. As you can see from this picture, one of the first rules, and rule number one actually, is to make sure that you have a trained adult with you at all times when using the saw. Um, even though you're going to pass these videos and you're going to answer all the questions correctly, it still is required that you have an adult present when you use the miter saw. Rule number two is that you wear goggles and ear protection anytime you are either using the saw or you're accompanying a group partner who might also be using the saw. So in other words, if you're standing near or around the miter saw while in use, you are also required to wear the safety goggles and the ear protection. Rule number three is uh, in regards to hair length. If you have long hair, then we're going to ask that you make sure that that hair is tied back. We don't want long hair getting caught in the saw, which could lead to pretty serious injury. So we'll ask that you tie back any long hair. And if you choose to use an apron, um, please also make sure that that apron is tied back appropriately. And then the final note is uh, not necessarily a rule, but a, a cautionary note. And that is to not wear gloves during the use of these saws. Uh, this, this, just in the same way that long hair and the uh, string from the apron can get caught in the saw, in the same way gloves can also get caught. So you do not wear gloves during the use of the saw. 